you know that demons and devils are two different things? Hi, I'm Chris Renshaw. In a previous video, we talked about expansions to D&D and role-playing games and how you had guides like Xanathar's Guide to Everything to explain player options. Well, something else that you always need to expand in an RPG is that of your monsters. And like, you need different monsters because sometimes it's hard to come up with that stuff on your own. With 5th edition D&D, Wizards has gone a different route, and they've started releasing these themed books, such as Mordekainen's, Mordekainen's, I have terrible pronunciation on that, Tomb of Foes. And what this book does is this book talks about the multiverse. In the grand multiverse of D&D lore, there are opposing forces that are always kind of battling out each other or just two groups of things that have always clashed against each other since the beginning of time for instance there's demons and devils as i mentioned before the book also goes into some minor disputes such as you've got elves and drow dwarves and duragar and even gnomes and halflings all these sorts of things inside the tomb of foes it talks about why these two different groups are fighting each other why no one side's really gotten the uppity and what would happen to the entire plane if this balance got thrown off if you're a kind of person that's looking to expand your DD game and you need some inspiration points tomb of foes is a good way to start do you think that having just themed kind of books for specific for expanding your game with different monsters and stuff or do you prefer the classic style of just let's release another book with a different number on it let me know down in the comments below make sure you check out the boards and swords podcast for other great rpg and board gaming stuff and follow me on social media for other great comments and questions but meantime until we talk again may all your hits be crits